For this recipe, you'll need four tortillas, seven to eight inches in diameter, one bundle of asparagus, one to two red peppers depending on the size, one small tub of garden vegetable cream cheese. Hi everybody, it's Mona. Today we're going to do a quick appetizer. We're going to do an asparagus red pepper tortilla roll. And it's great for a snack, it's great for the holidays. You can prepare it um, the night before or the morning of. It needs at least a half an hour to refrigerate. But uh, we need two red peppers, and those I've pre-cut so you don't have to watch me do that. Um, a bundle of asparagus, and that I have pre-cooked. All you need to do is boil some water and have it boil for about three to five minutes, depending on the thickness of your asparagus. You don't want it too limp. Um, you want it to still have a little life to it. So then you need four tortillas and the cream cheese and this happens to be a garden vegetable cream cheese and you could use an onion and chive you could use a plain cream cheese whatever is to your liking you can use so all you have to do is take a tortilla you have your spreader I happen to like the angled spreaders rather than the flat ones because they do a better job I think but if you let that go to room temperature, you kind of just spread it around the tortilla. Keep going. You don't want to go all the way to the edge, but you want to get pretty close. Scoot it around. Okay. Then you take you want two asparagus spears and you want um, three red peppers strips which I julienned before you put them here and all you have to do is roll it you want to roll it tight and get the vegetables in there go like that and if the ends are sticking out from the asparagus and stuff like that it doesn't matter these tortillas are about seven to eight inches in diameter, and that works fine, and they're flour tortillas. So you take a little cling wrap, which I've never been good at, so take it, there you go. Take your roll, put it down, and you kind of wrap it up nice and tight. There we go. And then you're gonna put it in the refrigerator for a minimum of a half an hour, but again, you can do it the night before. Here's one that I had prepared before. It's nice and cold from having been in the refrigerator. You unroll it, and you're going to cut out the ends so that you start to get a nice finished edge after that. You can see all the vegetables in there, then you cut it. That one was a little loose, but as you get closer to the middle, here you have the nice slices with the, with the vegetables and the cream cheese in the middle, and you just arrange that on your plate. And if you have any extra red peppers, you can certainly use that as a garnish on the plate as well. And there you have it. And if you put it on a nice white plate or a holiday plate, it'll really show up nicely. And here's the finished product put out on a platter. And this is only, this is probably less than half of what you'll get from your, from the entire recipe that we talked about. So thank you for watching. I hope you give it a try and I hope you enjoy it. Mona Shirt was provided by Chicky Limited. Be fun, be fabulous, be you. Make sure to visit them at www.chick-e.com. This has been a Craft Clutch production. Thank you for watching.